day folks welcome back to the channel if you're new here i welcome you if you're not new here i welcome you back so in this video we're going to be climbing that little beast right there that is pen or all when pen or all when in snowdonia national park so here we are we have thin ogwen you'll have seen this in other videos of mine if you've uh, seen some other videos we've been up these mountains here before but we haven't been up pen or all when so today, folks, we're going to go up Pen or All Wen. It is, sorry, I'm right by the road here, so it's going to be quite loud. Um, it's 978 meters high, so it's one of the smaller peaks in this national park, but it's still fairly substantial. So we're going to head up on this side of the lake, on the, on the most western point of the lake. We're going to head up the, the ridge there get to the peak and then we're gonna head down basically head down here very picturesque and back to the car park here so I've been wanting to do this for a long time and I've just been putting it off I don't know why so today is the day anyway folks without further ado I'm just gonna have a little walk along here I hope you can hear me the winds picked up a little bit now and then we're gonna head up there so we've had a nice little break in the weather today. Uh, this, well, late this morning. Pissing it down with rain this morning when I woke up. I thought, hmm, nah, ain't gonna do anything today. But it's brightened up, folks. It promises a good few hours now. So I thought, let's make the most of this. Make the most of this. Get up a mountain. So let's hope it doesn't piss it down when we're at the top of there, eh? <laughs> I've come prepared anyways. I've got my waterproofs, but here we go. Got the mighty Truv on there. One of my favourite peaks here, and I'm looking forward to seeing that from a different perspective. I've never seen it from from Penarolwen, obviously. Seen some nice photos online. Never done it myself. Anyways, let's continue. Yeah. So just to explain, we're going to the end here. Like I just said, we're going to go up the top here. We're going to come down and then back to the car park here but what you can do also you can just walk right along the base of the lake here there's another path that takes you right to the end there where we're going to begin i was hoping we could park where we're going to begin you see but um it's packed i've chosen the weekend to come which is not a clever move the mighty travan look her isn't she glorious like I said, I'm really looking forward to looking at her from that peak up there. Penarol Wen, Travan. So this is the main car park and cafe and everything there. That's in Ogwen. There you've got the guest house. So basically, we just need to go here to begin climbing that. Let's go. When you get to the base of it, it's quite daunting actually, very steep. It's a very steep, uh, it looks steep. <laughs> Let's go and find out if it is steep. Well, here we go, the beginning. And this is also the beginning of the Carnedi mountain range here. You've got the Glederais up there. And these are the Carnedis. So these head that way towards where I'm from, where, I'm, where I've been brought up down the Conway Valley. We have the Carnedis behind us there. So let's begin this path, shall we? Let's see where we end up. beginning's a bit of a scramble the path is not very obvious at all whether I've just uh, started in the right point or not I don't know but it shows right on the map here's a little path we have a little path here right now okay Shinogwen Devil's Kitchen a garden the Glider Ice 
Trava. And we're going this way, I think. Got all the beautiful heather out at the moment here in Wales. Very vibrant. It's all over the mountains up there. A little bit closer to the heather now. Look at all this. Ah, we have something what looks like a proper path now, folks. We have a proper path. I've just been scrambling up the edge there quite a bit. I just missed the path here. I've come straight up this. <laughs> I've missed the path right there. Anyways, onwards and upwards. Look at this, in between all of this beautiful heather. Absolutely stunning, man. Really nice time to come here to Snowdonia. Beginning of September when I'm recording this. So, future reference. Ooh. Ooh. It's a bit more of a scramble than I thought, actually, having to use your hands quite a bit here. Wasn't expecting that. I thought this was going to be one of the cuter hikes, but <laughs> no man, but I love it. Let's put the camera down for a sec. It's <laughs> the end of that, that little scramble. Some nice little rock formations there. Oh man, honestly. Travel in the distance there, all this heather. Absolutely beautiful. Beautiful. Well, to be fair, it's not very busy, which is a good thing. I thought with the weekend it'd be packed, but I think the weather's caught people out today, to be honest. I think uh, people checked the weather last night, saw it was going to be grim, and planned other things, which is great for me, because it means there's less people on, on the mountains. Anyway, the views are opening up now. Llynidwell is opening up. You can see that there now. Obviously, you can't see that from when you're down by the road. And there's Devil's Kitchen up to the Glidaris. I'm out of breath, folks. I'm out of breath. I'm going too fast again. And I'm a little bit unfit, I reckon. Anyway, I shouldn't be complaining, should I? Look at this. Beautiful. Oh, look at this. The first view of Hogwan Lake, where we were before. There's the car park we are parked at. So we walked along here and then up here. Got some clouds coming in. Hopefully not too many. And hopefully not rainy. Appreciating this little bit of flat land. Whew, it's been all uphill. Pretty steep, <laughs> as predicted. It's getting a bit slippery under the feet now. It's got a lot of loose stone in this part. The path isn't very obvious either. In places it's a little bit skew with. But I think I found it here. My map says I'm on the right path, so and this guy's on the path. a couple of times very un un unobvious but look at the views man Whew. a little bit further to the top of Penarol 
here we go, it's starting to flatten off now at the top. I'm pretty sure that's going to be the peak. It's quite a hike, folks, quite a hike. That was pretty challenging to be fair, but a really, really good scramble. Um, I stuck with a the guy there, actually, me and this other guy has just gone off there now, but we stuck together for a little while because it was uh, the path became really unobvious, you know, and uh, it doesn't take a lot to go wrong, even though the map said we were on track. But if you lose your GPS, which has happened to me before, uh, I shouldn't laugh really, but um, that can send you off, do you know what I mean? You can just, your screen will be frozen, you think you are in a certain, certain place and you're not. The peak of Penarolwen. Right here, folks. Wow, man. Wow. Just seen that side. When you get to the peak here, the views open up all over to Anglesey, the North Wales coast there. Carnet David. That's the next peak you get to. And then there's Carnet Llewellyn behind it. So you can continue this path basically. You can see it here. And that would take me home, folks, actually. That would take me home to where I am from. Grew up. But check that out, man. Let me just zoom in on that. So there. You can just see Puffin Island right there. That'll be Bumaris. All up the east coast of Anglesey. And just all of that land is Anglesey. You can see how flat it is. So you just see Newbra Beach down there. Absolutely stunning. My first time seeing these mountains from this perspective. And then once again you have Trovan. <laughs> Snowden right there. Cribgorch Ridge there. So many mountains in one spot that you can see. Stunning. So what the, the bit of path we've just done as well, it's part of the um, the 3000s, the Welsh 3000s. And if you continue that path there, going up to Rundar, uh, Carnid, Rabbit, Llewellyn, that's all part of the Welsh 3000 path, basically. So we're not heading that way back down, folks. We're gonna head back down this way. A nice picturesque walk down past past a little river and that I believe and some more beautiful views of Trovan so without further ado I reckon we go and do that before the weather takes a turn for the worst well there we go from Pen Arol Wen I hope you can hear me we're gonna head back down now we're going to head back down that way. Not a bad little spot to stop for lunch. Trovan in the distance, a little glimpse of Ogwen Lake down there, lovely little bench to sit on, perfect day, eh? out with the wind a little bit as well, anyways, just going to enjoy my lunch here folks, before traipsing down there, a bit of traffic here, a bit of congestion on the path, off your pop. Looks like we've got ourselves another little scramble here, folks. Thought it was all plain sailing from here, but... Which way to go? Which way to go? Oh, we've got some nice Welsh quartz here, folks. Beautiful Welsh quartz. Some nice little slab of it there as well. the end of the little scramble I think. 
this little lake here the river continues right down going off the map the path follows that right down to the main road now so i think that is the hardest part done peeps i'm hoping so anyway and if you listen closely you can hear the river here we have the river beautiful so we just follow this all the way down now to the low ground well, that wasn't a bad little hike folks i really really enjoyed that pretty challenging pretty demanding we just scrambled down that as well that's what we just uh <laughs> that's why i had to put the camera down before yeah it's a lot more challenging than i actually thought anticipated it was going to be to be honest with you um but yes that's always a good it's always good to have a challenge always good to see these things with your own eyes you know anyway i'm trying to get down here it's very boggy let me just get over here folks but yeah definitely a hike recommended here in snowdonia for sure Hold on. Come in peace. Yes. Peace. I think he comes in peace too. You come in peace. Peace. Well folks, on that note, <laughs> I think we'll say our goodbyes. The end of our video. At the beginning of the video, you'll remember me telling you that you can walk along the back end of the lake here as well, which will take you to where we first started to scramble. The, the walk right but my car's parked on the other side of the lake just there so i'm just going to continue down the path down the side there and head back to my car so i'm a little strapped for time folks i've got to go and see a friend who's a little bit poorly so i've got to go and uh, pay my condolences to her so without further ado i'm going to leave you the beautiful trovan beautiful snowdonia national park once again, it has impressed and places I haven't been that are on my own doorstep. And I've got other ideas for hikes now as well after seeing um, where it leads over to David and things like that. So, all right, folks, well, thanks for joining us. And until next time, take care and have fun.